this also smells like a fairy tale i feel like merida from brave would definitely be wearing a perfume like this hey guys i'm rachel if you're new or returning welcome and welcome back i do fragrance beauty and lifestyle i hope you stay to the end today we're getting into my favorite category of fragrances fall autumn fragrances the best fragrances for the cold weather if I was to be placed in a category of fragrances, it would definitely be fall. I love fall. I love fall fragrances. All my favorite holidays are in the fall season. I just love it. While we're here, tell me your favorite season and let's hop into this video. Autumn Vibes by Maison Margiela. Maison Margiela, again, is one of my favorite perfume brands. I said it before and I'll say it again. I just love how they capture moments and places and just put it in a bottle. It never ceases. To amaze me i also really just love the packaging as well autumn vibe smells like you are hiking on a trail and you're stepping on slightly damp leaves it's very earthy kind of like dirt but in a good way like the moss from the trees surrounding the trail just a very realistic fall scent without pumpkin and spice it's warm it's definitely unisex there's carrot seeds cardamom moss and maple this is just perfection for me in a bottle and it lasts all day i know that some of the perfumes do not last very long but this one lasts all day and they're edt so if you have an issue with the perfume lasting make sure your skin is very well moisturized over spray spray your clothes and layer that's a tip right there for you while we are on maison magella we might as well just talk about coffee break it's so cozy and it's not a predominantly coffee perfume coffee is more like the supporting notes of this perfume the notes that that speaks to me in this perfume are the lavender the vanilla the milk and of course the coffee but when you hear milk don't be scared it's not too lactonic it's not too sweet the notes are just very well balanced it's very calming and very cozy this gives me a vibe of a coffee shop that's just very small chic and intimate i love this one this one is one that i i feel like you have to overspray and layer with to get it to last a little bit longer but it's just it's just amazing i love it skyless fall cashmere this is the perfect homage to my favorite season fall they just really captured the essence of fall in this perfume i'm gonna read some of the notes that i have written here because it's a lot it's a lot that stands out to me almond ginger vanilla sandalwood musk cinnamon and cloves i definitely get those notes in this perfume it opens up spicy and the dry down is like an amber vanilla um, it's a bit woody but it still maintains that cinnamon note in the dry down as well throughout the perfume it's just so warm and spicy and it also gives me a little christmas vibes as well commodity book this smells like you're reading an old book underneath some trees it's woody it's creamy it's aromatic it's fresh and has just a subtle subtle sweetness to it this smells very similar to some popular perfumes like they're kind of in the same scent profile santal 33 by le labo and one of my favorites santal vini by the seven virtues i don't know if i mentioned but this is book expressive um they do have the personal expressive and bold line and they do differ by some notes and i prefer the expressive line in book i just love it this just speaks to my soul i love perfumes within that profile it's just it smells wonderful next i have odwell by diptyque this is a very aromatic green vanilla it's also a vanilla for those of us who do not like too much of an edible vanilla perfume it's clean and refreshing and it's a pretty unique scent in my opinion this also smells like a fairy tale. I feel like Merida from Brave would definitely be wearing a perfume like this. I'm a huge animation fan, you guys. I just love animation so much. So I definitely feel like Merida will smell like this because it has this juniper berries, it has black tea, it has musk and saffron. She definitely, you can't tell me otherwise, she smells like this. And this is a perfume that's just great for the fall weather. Marc Jacobs Perfect Intense. Me and this perfume have history. Now I sampled this perfume in Sephora and I loved it. I bought it. I wore it out and I hated it. I just found it was too almondy and just too thick, but I wore it in the summer. So when fall arrived, I was like, let me pull this out and try it again. And I fell head over heels in love with it. So I feel like the season had a very big impact of me hating or loving this perfume. And it's definitely a fall perfume for me. I would not wear it in the summer again. So it's like a, a comforting cloud of almond milk and white florals and i love me some florals florals is also one of my favorite category of perfumes it's a kind of unique scent in my opinion 
it's a very pleasant it's not so loud and in your face and it also lasts all day on me i have to force myself from wearing this perfume in the fall once i pick this bottle up i'm like ah i don't want to stop wearing it just smells so freaking good get your hands on this next we have montal ristretto intense cafe montal again is one of my favorite perfume brands it's up there with keali and maison magella it's a sweet gourmand but not too gourmand it's a coffee and rose dominant perfume but the coffee is like a creamy dark coffee with a deep rose this is very long lasting every time i wear this perfume i get compliments it leaves a sensual montal perfumes are usually long lasting majority that i've tried and they're also very oily they have a very high concentration of oils um, so i feel like when you spray them on your skin it's one of the perfumes you can actually rub in because it's so oily and it just lasts forever on your clothes as well i just love montal perfumes for longevity because for me longevity is king i don't care what anyone says i don't mind reapplying my perfume if i'm being very realistic with myself i do not like to reapply my perfumes and because of you know my lifestyle it doesn't allow me to apply my perfumes often so i just prefer to go for perfumes that are more long lasting but at the same time i don't mind reapplying a perfume that i really love but, but this one cross all all the boxes this next couple of perfumes i'm not going to go into depth about because i just did a video about them in my top 10 perfumes for life so i will link them in the card if you want to see an in-depth description about them but santo vini by the seven virtues i already said this is me in a bottle it's not too sweet it's a creamy vanilla it's very edgy and very unisex Kaoli invite only it's alluring it's seductive it's sexy it's a very exclusive it's in the name invite only Oglias angel muse edp i do not want to speak about this too much because i think it's discontinued i am not quite sure that's why i don't want to go too in depth with it but if it's a perfume you can get your hands on get your hands on it you will not regret it i wore the original angel perfume for years and i love it and i know it's not everyone's cup of tea this has the original angel um dna but it's just toned down it has chocolate and patchouli in this version and i love a little patchouli in my perfume i love the little earthy earthiness the little depth that it gives to the perfumes i i do i, I can handle a little patchouli here and there but like i said it's like a softer version more toned down version of the original angel it's a crowd pleaser it's a compliment getter it's just an entire vibe so if you can get your hands on this perfume like i said before get it you will not regret it so there we have it my best fall and autumn fragrances fragrances for cold weather comment some of your favorite down below as well let's start a conversation and i thank you so much for watching and i'll see you in my next video bye guys